This is a $10 million trampoline park and it's one of the biggest in the world. In this video, we're going to show you the difference between this, a $5 million super trampoline park, a $1 million trampoline park, all the way down to the cheapest park we could find. Starting with the $1 trampoline park. So this thing got to be one of the worst trampolines we've ever been on, but let's see if we can do any sort of flips on it. Go on then, Toby. <laughs> Every time the one pound trampoline just breaks my back. But there was one thing that really showed how bad this ah. park was. The thing is, when you bounce, you just hit the ground straight away. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard of an air track. Well, this is worse. <laughs> There's really not much we can do here. At the minute, I'm thinking side flips the most. The only. <laughs> <laughs> the only option. I actually <laughs> might not bottom out on this. Nope. Really? I didn't. I didn't bottom out. <laughs> I hit the ground so hard. I don't think you understand how much hitting the floor hurts on a trampoline. I guess that's what you get for one pound. Conclusion is these are worse than the other one pound trampoline. Let's check out what a $100,000 trampoline park looks like. For $100,000, your trampoline park starts to look a little bit better. But there was one problem. All these trampolines, they're just mediocre. Do you know what I mean? They're all right. And to show you what we mean. Right, give us a max height test. That is not the noise you want to be hearing from a trampoline. I'll tell you that much. Definitely impossible to hit the roof in there. So that might be a problem in one of the other trampoles we're going to. This park hasn't really got that much to offer, but just stick around until we go to all of these trampoline parks, especially this one, because there's some nuts stuff going on at that one. So as you can clearly tell, this park doesn't have anything for professional athletes to train. We're running out of things to do. This is not a fun park. But before we pack up and move on, we have one more challenge to do. Breaking the rule by doing a double flip. So let's get it done and then get kicked out. We got away with it. Let's leave. <laughs> now we're at the one million dollar trampoline park. Now, if you would have seen one of our videos before, you would have seen one of these. You're a tramp freestyle. This trampoline alone is worth twenty thousand dollars. And this is what pro trampolinists train on. And here we have one of the best flippers in Finland to show you five flips. A million dollars for Marco if he does this right now. Really? A million Zimbabwe dollars. One million dollars. That's good. Oh. Oh, he's got it back. Yeah. How many times did he say I'm just kidding? Yeah. 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 yeah! And if you thought that was nuts, just wait for the $10 million tramp park because this gets so much more insane. Thank you, Marku. I will pay you a million Zimbabwe dollars. Now, where do we go? We've got a whole foam leg and we can practice whatever we want into this. No risk of getting hurt. So, for that, I'm going to try a trick no one's ever done before. No one's even conceived this. Backflip to front flip in one jump. That was a solid attempt. Now we've got another really good finish flipper to show you a good trick into the foam pit. Dad, I'm sorry. Do it for your son slash daughter. Oh, Oi! Oh, and this park also has the biggest trampoline in this video so far. This trampoline is 10 by 20 feet, which is about 3.1 tenths in diameter. I'm six foot four. As you can see, I'm a lot taller than these lot. Um, this trampoline is very useful because it's got a big f***ing wall. And Felix is going to show us what the big wall can do. You can't call yourself finished if you can't do this. Oh my Ooh. god. Oh my oh, god. Oh, 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 hey. Hey. All right, can someone help me get down? So there's one more part of this trampoline park which really makes it live up to that million dollar hype. It's this, a giant mega ramp. And obviously this isn't a trampoline, but it helps with the value of the park, making it hit around a million dollars. And what are you gonna do, Frass? I'm gonna do a double backflip on a scooter. Right. What you want, when you want. Big double back on a scooter. One, two. Oi, clean. Now this park also has something even cooler. Just through this wall. And this is the $5 million trampoline park. Now the reason that this trampoline park costs $5 million is because you can go from beginner all the way to the best flipper in the world right in these walls. I mean, the corner of this trampoline park is already the $100,000 one. And that's just like a fifth of this place. Now even better than that, we have five completely custom made Olympic level trampolines that go into foam pits, airbags, and generally are just really good to train your tricks on. We've even got whatever the hell this thing is. What, the, what is this? Yes, Dad, easily. But hang on a minute. That wouldn't make this park cost $10 million. The real thing that makes this park special is the fact that we have not just one, but two of the best trampolines in the world. If you remember from this video here, these trampolines cost $50,000 and pretty much all the best trampoline tricks in the world have been done on these. We're going to do a quick challenge on this trampoline, see if I can touch the ceiling. Here he goes. Can he touch the roof? Let's find out. Up 
Yeah! There you go, you almost touched England. Hey. Having a proper sesh now. Turn this trampoline park, pull out a world's first six two for trunk flip. Yeah. If you can't do 10k for a sweet, then yes, I don't want to yes. hear no chat about yeah. <laughs> Well done, brother. Well done. Well done. Well done. Not only is this an amazing trampoline park, but it's also situated in one of the most beautiful locations in the world, Queenstown, New Zealand. But now it's time for us to fly back to Europe so we can go to the $10 million trampoline park. This park has everything you can need. It has 50 mini trampolines, a 10 by 10 meter air track, a Russian swing, three huge towers into an airbag. And check this thing out. <laughs> But what we're really here for is the 18 super trampolines. And those ones over there were literally used in the Olympics. As a flipper, you want all levels of super trampoline to really refine your tricks. In this park, we have three levels of super trampoline. Your standard Euro trampoline used in the Olympics. Your 5x5 trampolines that freestyle athletes train on. And then the best trampoline in the world. And the last thing about this park is you can pretty much do whatever you want. There's almost no rules. So we can do stuff like this. Now because this tramp park is so good, some of the most famous flips of all time have been done in it. And I'm willing to bet that you've seen this park in one of these clips here. Now you f***ed it. No, I'm joking. Woo! Yes! <laughs> now this place isn't only good for its trampolines. All the weird random stuff you can do around it. It's winter right now, and this place is literally perfect for training splash diving for summer. Might try a trip front of the fire. Too easy, mate. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Wow. It's doable. Now that was the $10 million trampoline park. If you made it this far, comment down below which trampoline park you want to go to the most. Like, comment, subscribe. Radio flips, ow!